summon. Or his first time. Love to see it happen. Trap. And slap. What is the five fingers? Say to the face! What? Slap! Greetings and welcome back to Morrowind. So, we're getting pretty far along in the storyline in terms of um, the prof the prophecies. Um, and in order to take on one of the uh, prophecies that's coming up, specifically the fourth one, which you're not at yet, but I wanted to take care of this as soon as possible. Um, there is a way to shorten that a bit by joining, by uh, reaching the highest rank in one of the three great houses. Which is kind of funny because I really didn't intend on joining any of the houses in this run, but I did to, as a means of uh, practicing magic skills. And uh, now that gives me an opportunity to rise in the ranks in Telavani and not have to deal with that whatever side quests come with the main quest that is uh, the fourth prophecy, which we'll get to. Speaking of raising levels, uh, I've done some practice. Uh, if you look over to the right end of the screen, you can see I have a couple training spells, one for alteration and one for destruction. And then if you look over here, yeah, I've been casting those spells quite a bit. I kind of um, took the idea and I had, I had the last episode and run with it. I so Honestly, I should do this with as many other... Uh, skills as possible, but um, I can really only do that with spells. Uh, the other skills are a bit uh, more complicated. But uh, yeah, the reason I uh, grinded for Destruction 80 and Alteration 70, well, Alteration 70 so I can cast Wall of Levitate with some level of uh, chance, which I think is up like, yeah, it's 60% uh, chance to, cat to successfully cast Wall of Levitate, which is. Uh, Nice. Of course, that's at full um, fatigue, but you know. And then uh, destruction was so I could rise in the ranks. Uh, if I actually scroll down, I go to the Great House Telvani, you'll see that destruction is indeed one of the ranks there. And that's the same goes for the major skill. Destruction is in there as well. So I can go back and rise in rank further in the major skill and maybe fight. Um, Drabonius, that's a thought. Right now, though, I want to focus on House Telvanni because being the leader of that faction will help with the upcoming main quest. Right, so, uh, with that in mind, I apparently left this there here at some point. I'll go ahead and snag that back up. I want to talk to you, and I want to talk to you about advancement specifically. Okay, so, I am qualified for wizard, but I must first build a stronghold. Okay. I had a feeling I was at this point, so let's talk about the stronghold. For matters regarding your tower, you should speak to Lunera Laren in the Telvani Council House in Sadrith Mora. Cool. So yeah, in order to actually be the leader of the of House Telvani, I need my own wizard's tower. And uh, let's see here, I am eligible for that. I just need to go and. Uh, Fill out the forms, get the necessary materials, etc., etc. Okay, depending on where this is, I might want to set it closer to the Telephony Council House. Yeah, that's not a bad idea, actually. Let's go ahead and prepare Mark because I'm going to cast it. And yeah, I'll be back when I get uh, to there because so, my uh, athletic still is pretty big, still pretty bad. Right, so the lady that uh, Ariane wanted me to talk to is at the bottom of this, uh, of the council house, so I'm gonna have some uh, walking to do to descend into the lower levels here. And to do that, I'm gonna have to go through the tribunal uh, area. Alright, so, pardon me, I don't want any trouble, I'm just passing through. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't like seeing me, but he didn't say nothing, so that's good. Alright, so now I need to get around here. 
Okay, and I need to talk to you. Is there something I can do for you? Alex? Yes, I would like I would uh like to discuss my stronghold. Okay, so she needs a construction contract from Duke Phantom Dren and Evan Hart. And then I, she needs me to bring two strong souls. Which if I talk to her about strong souls, she'll give me some Dren soul gems. Which uh, is useful since I didn't have any. Then I can talk to her about the construction strong bat, um, contract. And she explains that a lot of Telvani agents have been making uh, houses of their own. Uh, without consent from the higher ups in the house. Which, mo for most of the time, like, they generally don't care. Because the Tavani's just like that. But, um... Lunella here wants to go through the proper channels for my tower. Just, you know, you know, just in case. Which, fair. Better to be safe than sorry, right? Cool. So, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and mark. And I'm going to rewrite my Sadrith Mora mark to here because I'm going to be needing to talk to her quite a bit. Which granted, I don't need to max out my tower in this run. I really only just need to get it functional to the point where I can uh, rank up more. Normally, I would go crazy with it, but eh, it's not really important for this, for this run. Right, so... Um, See here, I don't have any recalls. Eh, actually, I can just use divine intervention. This is something I should have brought up sooner, by the way. It says teleportation magic doesn't work here. Um, that's a glitch between the multi mark plugin and the tribunal expansion, and it ultimately doesn't mean anything, so don't mind it any. And yeah, I apologize, I should have brought that up sooner. Right, so. Duke, Speak, the Duke Traveler. is here somewhere. I just gotta find him, and that's the wrong way. Yeah, I don't want the Imperials um, giving me trouble, so, so I need to want? figure out where this uh, stairwell I'm looking for is. And I believe. I wanna say this is it. Yeah, okay, this is the one. Let's so I need to talk to you. Traveler. But make it quick. About a construction contract. And yes, I vow to do what I can for your people. Cool. So, let's see here. Let's go ahead and recall. Back to the, uh... Back to Sageth Mora. Now, I don't know if I can do this. It's, uh, let me... I might need to use a scroll or something, but let me see. Uh, yeah, here we go. Summon Storm Entry Knock. And, uh, yeah, no, I cannot cast that right now. So, see here, I'm pretty sure I have some, uh, Summon Golden Saint Scrolls if I didn't sell them. Yeah, I probably sold them. Ah, hmm. uh, right. Well, I'm, uh... Wait, don't... Okay, well, I thought I, uh, had something that, uh, from Arianne that would help with that, but no, that's a bit above where we're at right now, so. Yeah, cool. I guess I need to train, um, Conjuration up some. I'll be right back. Later. I raised my Conjuration level up a little bit, going up from 25 to 30, and then... I actually look at the spell at the uh, summon Atronach spell, and it was summoned for 60 minutes. I don't need a live along. I literally need to just summon it, soul trap it, and then kill it. So I decided to make a spell that summons it for about 20 seconds, which should be enough to soul trap it and then slap it a few times with the. Uh, New spell uh, I just made that deals non-elemental damage. Quite a bit of it, in fact. Let me show it off. Let's see here. There it is. Trashy's Wrath. Damage health, 200 points on touch. I should probably save before trying to do what I'm about to do, just to make sure it 
that the uh, da nine elemental damage doesn't get reflected back onto me. But uh, I think this is going to be the best way to get these souls that I need. So, let's see here. Fortunately, um, she doesn't mind fights going taking place down here as long as she doesn't get you know involved. You know, like she, they're not within range of her or whatever. This looks to be a good enough spot. Okay. Let's grab the swift summon spell. Now, I might fail this quite a bit because my uh, conjuration spell skill is, uh, yeah, it's pretty low. But it, it's at least man, it's at least possible to cast this thing. So let's go ahead and uh, give it a few attempts. There we go. Let's see here. Immediately soul trap. Now, I would use. Uh, wait, did I not hang on to that? Right, well, never mind then. Let's just go ahead and try to fight this thing and save the game first, just in case. Cool. Alright, I need to do that one more time, so. Swift summon. Works first time. Love to see it happen. Trap. And slap. Slap. There we go. And I didn't even lose all that much uh, magic in the process, <laughs> at least compared to how much I have. Cool. So now we should have everything we need to get the um, stronghold up and running, and that's where the hard part starts because it doesn't finish right away. You have to do some waiting. So she, yes, I will use these souls to begin construction on your stronghold. Let me give you something that will help you understand how Salalutarvani's uh, reasoning for building a stronghold in Uvera's grave. And then I talk to a stronghold again. Construction uh, on your stronghold will begin soon. Yeah, it doesn't even start right away. You literally have to wait. And by wait, I mean what this. Want, Outlander? Uh, multiple 24-hour periods until you get a journal update. Yeah, that's how that works. Which, I mean, makes sense because they are building a new building from scratch. So, it would take time. But, so. Right. Uh, let's see here. I can't rest here, but I can wait. So, we're just gonna... See, normally when I uh, play this game, I try to do things during these periods. But, I ended up running out of things to do pretty quick <laughs> in the process. So, I usually end up just waiting anyway. And it's usually about five days in between uh, stronghold updates. And because of a certain mod I have, uh, once the, I get this first update, she's going to have me check on it. And then I'm going to wait another five days for it to be constructed properly. Instead of it, instead of it being... Uh, so it gets constructed in ten days instead of five. But uh, that's just the price I pay for having good mods. So she wants me to check on the progress of my strongholds uh, that's being built on the alleged site of... Uh, Yvera's grave. Uh, she marks it on my map so I can go there and talk to the foreman, uh, or foreman, in charge of constructing. In charge of construction. Yeah, the reason this isn't in the Villanelle game is because it's a mod that, uh, lets you talk. I think actually, I think I'm wrong about this. I think you actually do talk to the foreman and that she's a vanilla character, but, like, the mod uses her to let you can build a city around your tower. But I won't be doing that. I won't even be fully mastering the tower. I'm just doing this to help with the main no quest. Right, so I will be back when I get to the uh, tower. Right, so this is her. So yeah, she introduces herself. Um, says I'm here about my tower, tell you Ferith, And then uh, I'm to tell Lunara that things are fine here. And the work will be done soon. She talks a certain way. I think it's just supposed to be an accent. I don't know. Say but yeah, uh, we will do that. So let me go ahead and put a mark here. Just in case, like, the phase one isn't enough and I need to do other things. Go ahead and make that mark six, I guess. You know, just in case. I don't actually expect to need to come back here for the rest of the run. And yeah, let's go report. to you, and yes, I'm here to strong discuss the stronghold. Right, she's pleased to hear that the mushroom is growing well. Uh, 
birthday is grateful for being kept informed. And yeah, it should finish its first day of shift growth in a few days. Five days, to be specific. And I'm being uh, given some things we don't need to discuss. Right, so more waiting. And then I can uh, talk to Arion and get my rank up and proceed through the Tauri storyline from there. Go talk to her, discuss stronghold. Come on, there you go. All right, and now she's in, in, asking me if I want to be to have a tower built, uh, fit for the for Tavani counselor. I'm not worried about that. She wants some drakes, and she wants she wants actually a lot of drakes, and she wants uh, some blueprints. But I'm not too worried about that right now. If Ariane asks me to do it, then I'll do it. Otherwise, I'm not going to bother. So right. Now, speaking of Arion, that's who I need to talk to next. Cool. Cool. Uh, that's right, so let's rank up. Cool. And talk about advancement again. And yeah, I need to do more duties. Right, so let's talk to you. And right now he wants me to find a Redoran in a Tovani Tower known as Shishi. So... I have quite a bit of traveling to do. Okay. Looks like I finally, uh... Looks like I finally made it here. Took long enough. Alright, let's take care of business then. Alright, let's drink a... F let's drink a... Store Fatigue Potion because, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna be thrown right into combat here. Oh, yeah, there's a dead toe body right there. There's a few more lettering the, uh... Ground here, that's unfortunate. And I'm just gonna have to show them what happens when you mess with the great house. I have the greatest, but the greatest house, really. <laughs> One cast, and I cast it a second time, but I really didn't need to. Uh, yeah, I don't think yeah, I need any of that stuff. Not really useful. Let's take the hearth heal and cast. And prepare my wrath once more. Your beat. Speed. <laughs> okay. Cast the heal. And then I need this, uh... Uh, yeah, this skull. But I didn't grab it, I twisted it, which means there's a secret trap door right here. Yeah, this wasn't here before. Go ahead. So, now let's talk I'm to you listening. and talk to you about Shishi. Cool. Got a couple of books. Alright, but that's the quest done. Pretty easy to get get into now that I have a really, really strong spell that isn't bound to time like before. Could have done that a lot sooner, but didn't. Well, I mean, to be honest, the whole reason I can cast it with little to no problem now is because my destruction is so high, so there is that. Let's see here. Right, recall. But yeah, pretty easy quest, just kind of a pain to get there. So, go back to Arion. To him about Sishi and then ask for another chore. Alright, if I wish to become a master in House Telvani, I must have someone to represent me in the council hall. Find a promising Telvani to be my mouth. I found the place pretty fast actually, just a quick recall and then my first hunch was correct. Because I have remember this game a bit better than I thought I did. Alright, so let's talk to you about mouth. You want me to be your mouth? Yes. If I'm your mouth, uh, you'll be my patron. You'll need to give me a silver staff of peace. Telvani tradition. Yes, give it. Go ahead and take it. i waiting for years to be someone's mouth. I won't disappoint you. I'll go to the council hall right away. If you want me to do any more chores, any chores for you, just let me know. Cool. A warm welcome to you. Recall back to Arion. Uh, yes. Alright, so I think this one, Arian's Helper, is the one that summons, uh, 
They just that would have been useful earlier, but hey, it's what it is. Right, next tour. The other great houses have also built strongholds without the Duke's charter. Uh, we can defend our buildings, the other houses cannot. So go to the Lalu stronghold and uh, beat somebody up. Cool. Go ahead and talk to you about this person just to get the journal. Right. Alright. Yep. Recall. I feel go back to Balmora. And this one's going to have me walking south of the town. It's not that big a walk, though. The, um, the Red Iron Stronghold is a lot more of a hassle to get to than the Halalu Stronghold is. Alright, we are here. And now, I get to slap more um, Halalu booty. But first, um, I don't think I ever did get that. She is Halalu. It legitimately doesn't matter. Now you die. She says before falling flat on her butt. Hmm. Glass weapons. Don't mind if I do. Uh, the rest of her stuff doesn't seem all that valuable, though. Let's see here, our people aren't going to say nothing, right? Yeah, they're still standing around. Cool. Let's head back. To Arion, then. Talk to him. Is it nice to have dead? Yes. So now, right now, so Rethan is no more. You are a credit to your ho house, Starashi. Yeah. Uh, more chores. Right, Renner Stronghold next. So let's talk to you about Bannon and Doris. Yeah, so this one's between Alrun and Morgan. That's, um,. That's a considerable more. That's a considerably yeah, considerably greater distance. So yeah, this one's gonna take a while. Be right back. Okay, I think this is it finally. I hope it is. Okay, yeah, it kind of looks like it. Let's head on in then. And I'm going to want to pop another uh, Restore Fatigue Potion for what I'm about to have to do. Head on down here. Door doesn't need to be giving me any trouble this time, please. Alright, go in here then, and close the door, because this guy's immediately going to attack me. So I slap, and he gets one shot. Or not. Okay, two shot then. Uh, I think I'll snag these for myself. Because they're pretty high quality. Uh, let's see here. Jewelry's worth a little bit, and I'll hang on to those. Other than that, I think I don't think I need anything else that he has. So we can head back to Arion. Hello. Yeah, he did. We welcome you freely, Hatley. Cool. Alright. More chore. Only one thing remains that prevents you from declaring yourself magister. You must see. Lunella Hilarin once and once more and find out what must be done to d defend your stronghold and discourage Redren or Hawalu where he retaliation. Yeah, so he wants me to get my stronghold ring too. Uh, well, I've done quite a bit, so I think we can. Hang on. I want to focus on you, the viewer here. I've done quite a bit as it is for this video, so I think I'll save that for another one. I was hoping to go ahead and clear this out today, but... Yeah, the blueprints she wants are defended by um, some pretty nasty folk in a pretty nasty place. So, I think I'll hold off on that. If you got this point in the video, it means the world to me, as it always does. I hope you enjoy it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Farewell.
impact. He's strong with this one.